Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Finally, I started to make videos, you know. Uh, actually, I couldn't make videos about three weeks and I missed you a lot. Thank you for watching my videos and thank you for supporting me. I'm really happy that a lot of people supporting me and, you know, uh, they are just giving me suggestions about making videos. And today, I've decided to make video and... Uh, let's start today's topic will be really interesting uh, because it's really interesting for me and i think uh, you, this will be interesting for you too okay let's start tradition or fashion i know it seems a little bit stranger for you and you can say Oh my gosh, what the hell, what, what about our talking? But you know what? When you ask this question from people, they tend to answer it. Oh my gosh, you are kidding me? Yes, sure. Tradition. Without any doubt, I can say that tradition is better than fashion. But what a pity. More and more we are talking this and at the same time we are not following tradition maybe closing you know especially girls i don't want to i don't want to just discredit girls i just want to mention our one of the biggest issue which is uh, taking place in our society you can say oh my gosh you are just uh, it's not such a big deal it's not your business maybe you are right because you know anyway it is affecting to our society it is affecting to our young generation I don't want to say that you have to wear what we call chapon or dope or this kind of clothing. No, I'm not talking about this. I'm talking that we have to have limit. You know, it's kind of uh, flowing, imitating other people. I mean, from the other countries, European people, people from the USA. <laughs> Learning language is great, but more and more people tend to just follow. Uh, their culture, maybe some of them, they are following their religion. I don't want to just criticize you guys. I just want to mention that it is really, really bad. And it is affecting to every person in our society. I know that we are responsible for buying this kind of clothes. We are, I mean, husbands, brothers, every, every man. And we are responsible for buying clothes to our daughter, to our woman, to our wife, maybe, to our siblings. And you know, sometimes we don't know, even we don't know about meaning of the, that kind of clothing system. I don't know, clothing, I mean dressing. For example, you know, some of them are uh, from the, I don't know, from the USA, from the European countries, for example, you know, I heard that. Uh, repeat jeans and this kind of uh, style uh, styles are uh, from the USA and uh, a lot of people uh, from the USA who just uh, uh, were sent to the prison they used this style and that was kind of how can I say sign for other people I don't want to talk about this because I think all of you know about this but we are wearing this and we are just uh, trying to imitate them even we don't know the, the meaning of that things it's kind of sign to other people and to I don't want to mention this it's really really bad thing that people say uh, man it's not your business but why you are talking about this you know actually it's our business I'm talking about our society we're spoiling our society with this I mean with the clothing with the just dressing this kind of clothes you know what you can say it's not a problem it's not such a big deal that i believe that it is one of the biggest problem in our society because you know with this uh this is appearing some kind of problems for example one of the biggest problem in our society nowadays divorces you know uh with this problem divorces are increasing more and more just husbands uh, say to their uh, wife, okay, wear normal clothes while you are wearing like this. 
and then from this uh, they are just uh, uh, arguing with each other and and then even with this problem they can just divorce between each other yeah and before I just want to say that we have to have limitation about this unfortunately nowadays when you just uh, say something about this to someone uh, they tend to just argue with you they tend to shout to you but at the same time it is our business it's business of our society and you know what in the past my parents that talk at me that when uh, elder people just say something say something to uh, young generation they just listened and they just try to follow them but unfortunately now we are we are not like them we tend to just uh, arguing we tend to argue with them why I don't know and you know I think we have to just be like a Uzbek like a real Uzbek and I don't want to say that you don't have to go abroad you don't have to leave there study or make money but you know just pay attention to other countries for example in other countries for example you know uh, Indian you know Indian every time where they closes you know I don't know how they name that uh, kind of clothing but I know only sorry you know uh, girls uh, just tend to wear them all, all the time you know even if they are in other countries when I just work it in an hotel for a while I, I just uh, uh, saw one uh, woman with the sari I mean uh, she was from the uh, India and I said oh my gosh you know it's kind of sign I mean not it's kind of sign it's like uh, how can I say spreading the name of your country to, to the world and I just realized that she was from the India you know and also uh, when it comes to China you know in China girls tend to wear uh, their their clothing I'm not talking about uh, those uh, who are like uh, how can I say living there now I mean in the past they wear uh, this kind of clothing and maybe now they are not wearing them but anyway they tend to make uh, how can I say films about their history I mean they appreciate their history all the time they make videos about the history about their traditions and it's kind of you know uh, keeping the tradition unfortunately we in our country we uh, you know uh, people are making uh, films but this kind of films are not really good I mean they don't have uh, good quality we are watching that yeah it is kind of amusing story it's funny and we are watching them but it's not about our tradition I think we have to just uh, I don't know make vid videos or make some kind of films with uh, I don't know in order to just make our young generation aware about our tradition you know sometimes it, it is it is really really uh, how can I say annoying you know it interrupts to guys I mean wearing and uh, because of this is appearing a lot of problems I don't want to uh, abuse or I don't want to say some abusive words uh, you know about this better than me but I just want to mention that it's really bad Maybe you can say, maybe you, you are, I don't know, you know, I'm specialist actually. I talk at what I want to talk. Thank you for wa watching my video, guys. And please don't take it close to heart. Uh, that was only just, uh, I'm gonna say, uh, speech. My speech, my opinion. And it's your life, it's your choice. And do what you want to do. I don't want to just... Uh, order to you to do something uh, just it is what just okay guys I'm, I'm really speechless because when I talk about this topic I wonder and I cannot say something 
exactly because uh, you know it's a kind of hard question for everyone I think okay what would you prefer tradition or fashion be honest ask this question sleep on it thank you for watching guys